Hello everyone. After completing the quest Hostage of Circumstances, right here, you're now able to enter you're now able to enter the scientist bunker. <laughs> Excuse me, and you're able to talk with a familiar face you've been trying to track all over the zone since Corden. Well, if you picked up the doll that is. In the mission, the long awaited meeting, you're supposed to go to Yantar and talk to Maxim Kramer. If he and if he's still alive, you must talk to him and talk about the doll. So He's inside of this room, according to the map. Excuse me. And uh, once we go inside, we're able to meet Maxim Kramer in all of his glory. Uh, what the fuck is this thing? Uh, I have no idea why the developers decided to make uh, Maxim a, uh, a static object instead of an NPC. But the results are horrifying. Oh my god. It's like Pinocchio. It scares the hell out of me. So let's talk to him anyways. Maxim da, da, Kramer. Ja so I'd, I highly recommend you waiting all this dialogue by yourself on your own time. I'm just going to quickly skip through it. Oops. Da, da, ja so you have two options. You can either hand over the doll to Maxim Kramer, or you can, or you can keep on to the doll. So if we pick this option, I have no intention of selling my friend. He'll give you this option. He'll give you an ultimatum. This artifact is like this artifact, which is the doll, is like a parasite on your brain. It's causing you harm to your energy and health. Uh, that's actually not true. I don't think the I, the doll actually heals you. In fact, so yeah, there's no literally no downside to the doll. Besides, the re reward for participating is a pretty good one. Two hundred thousand rubles. What do you say? You can either give him the doll for 200,000 rubles, or you can keep the doll. So what is the better option? Well, I'm just gonna... The better option's pretty uh, clear. Um, it, I'd highly, highly recommend you keep in the doll, because 200,000 rubles, it, like, that's a lot of money, but the money doesn't really have a big use in this game, especially if you handed the death lamp and garbage for 1 million rubles. You'll just have a bunch of rubles sitting in your inventory and not knowing what to do. So, I'd highly recommend you just... Uh, keeping the doll and not agreeing to the operation and uh the doll is um the doll really doesn't do you any harm like look at this guy do you really trust maxim kramer this abomination of a person like telling you what like telling you about your health i wouldn't let him go near my dad he's abomination so just pick i won't do it i highly recommend it it's i think it's the better option overall no i will not i will not give you the doll <laughs> And by declining it, you're now not able to speak with Maxim. You failed the mission, the long-awaited meeting, and the doll will say, you've made the right choice. Well, that's easy for you to say. You are about to die. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I just recommend giving you, I just recommend keeping the doll because it'll give you some pretty good, it'll give you some pretty decent benefits in the army warehouses. And um, she'll spot, like, backpacks on trees, and she'll give you hints for quests, and give you hints for the better options and outcomes in quests. She's She'll basically just do whatever she's been doing for the past few maps she's been on. So uh, just keep the doll. I think it's the better option overall, and you're now able to leave this uh, horrible, horrible man abomination behind, and you're able to do whatever else is in Yantar and in the other parts of the map, other parts of the game. So that's all I wanted to share with you guys. See ya!